Tim and Ashley, good morning. And one of the leaders on that COVID-19 task force is Dr. Marcella Nunez-Smith. She is a professor here at Yale University and teaches general medicine and also epidemiology. Now, this is not her first time on a COVID-19 task force. She also helped with here in Connecticut with Governor Lamont as far as his reopen committee and also just dealing with the COVID-19 pandemic here in Connecticut. The Biden-Harris transition team says the advisory board will help shape federal response for managing the surge in reported infections, ensuring vaccines are safe and affected, effective and distributed efficiently in protecting at-risk populations. Governor Lamont's chief of staff, Paul Mounts, tweeted out saying the Biden-Harris transition choice of Dr. Marcella Nunez-Smith of Yale School of Medicine to co-chair the COVID-19 task force is a testament of her amazing work as a leader in the field of health equity. She also served on Lamont's reopen committee and supported our state's COVID-19 response. Now, this morning, we did speak to one of Dr. Nunez and Smith's colleagues here at Yale University. Here's what he had to say about this announcement. Well, it's, of course, wonderful news for Yale University and for Marcella, uh, but I think it's a very wise decision by the Biden administration. Marcella is a top-notch researcher. She's from the U.S. Virgin Islands. That's where she was born and raised. And she has uh, cutting-edge research projects studying access to uh, COVID tests in the USVI and in Puerto Rico, here in Connecticut. She, she knows the challenges very well, and she knows the opportunities, too. Also, another, another Connecticut and Yale University connection here. We're talking about David Kessler. He is a former commissioner of the FDA and also served as the dean of the School of Medicine from 1997 to 2003. We're live in New Haven. Lisette Nunez, Fox 61 News.